Oh my god, they're ravages. Oh, <laughs> damn it! Hello everyone and welcome straight back to Horizon Zero Dawn 2, where we're going to leave the cauldron now. Hopefully nothing goes wrong. So I think this is the way we get out. I've also given myself skill points to get towards the next archer uh, perk, so I'm just going to go all in on archer. Oh, 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 oh. I meant to swipe. Look at that. We can see everything. How pretty. All right, let's keep going. Oh, look, they've got an elevator in the middle. That'd be nice if we could use that. But no, we've got to go up 10... Oh. All personnel must vacate the facility immediately. Okay. What exactly was this place? Seen anything like it before? No. No. Ooh. Wow. It's like a scan facility. Turn it on. Brainwasher. <laughs> there. Ooh. That's our way out. Error. Unauthorized access. Initiating facility lockdown. Oh. Stay What's going on? Well, at least the emergency lights work. What just happened? Minerva's definitely here. Ooh. And I think it's trying to keep us out. I'll scout ahead. See if there's a way to get us in. Oh, okay. You sure we shouldn't come with you? Well, yeah. Minerva could be dangerous. Let me make sure it's safe. Okay. We'll be right here if you need us. <laughs> she hasn't done a very good job of closing the door, did she? <laughs> oh, God. Ah. Okay. Hmm. Well, I guess we drop ledge. Do I want to go down? I feel like I should... I mean, I want to go up, right? Like, that's... That's a logical thing, isn't it? To go up. I mean, I could keep going down. But there's there's no point. Because down there is nothing. So, well, I guess we'll just go up. I think. Um... I guess we'll crawl over and then circle it. Yeah! Like a bouse. So yeah, we're gonna keep these Horizon Zero Dawn videos coming. Are you doing okay, Zoe? Yep. Yeah. How can I hear them? I'm in so. the blooming thing. All this, Minerva, Hephaestus, oh. Gaia. This is what will help heal Planes. Okay. I need it's to find to where Minerva's hiding. I barely understand. I should look for a way to access the facility yeah. systems. Yeah. Just, just ignore them, chatting. It's fine. Oh. Yeah, the editing, there won't be, like, too much in this, just because I kind of need to get this out, as well as do other things. You are not wanted here. Yes, I am. Nope. No! Sorry. You're not getting rid of me that easily, Minerva. Don't make me pry open the door. What are those cables in the center for? Oh, what is this? Looks like those cables connect to something above. Seems promising, if I can find a way up there. Okay, okay, so we need to get up. Oh, God. I love that. <laughs> oh. Oh, that's where I came in. Right. Okay, well, I guess we go this way. There's loot in here, apparently. I might be able to pull that open. Four berries. Four berries in an ancient thing. That's that's wonderful. All right. Here we go. Which way? Ooh. I can't... Can I not do the thing? I can't do the thing here. So I guess we're... Oh. So, ooh, there's a chest, though. Sweet. Can we go up? No, we can't. Okay, so there's nothing here. Brilliant. Wait, there must be something else. Ah. Ah. So I did a did something that was, you know, a little bit of a sidey thing. <laughs> Very unlike me. Oh, I can dance. It's got their moves. I can feel a draft above. Might be a way out of this shaft. It's got to keep this the Bitcoin cool. Oh. <gasps> Gleam stuff. Take it. Yes. I like Gleam. Don't know what... I still don't know what it does. But, uh... hey oh. Let's keep on moving. Oh! Another part of the facility. Door is locked. Oh. I don't even know where I'm going. Am I, can I pry it open? I can't pry it open. Oh, this will be something for the future that I've got to backtrack. Right yeah, hundred percent. See what else I can find. <laughs> what was it like? The armor, the armor in the other one was like, no, nah, you have to go back and find it now. Uh, so we want to climb up. 
want all the collectibles. Ooh. Ooh. I guess I'll just I leave them in there to die. I need to find a way back into the facility. Maybe I can look for a way in higher up the mountain. Oh, look. It's like that log. You could do something with that log, you know. Logs are very good. Uh, yeah. Why am I going up here? If I can get Minerva to cooperate, I can merge it with Gaia. Finally bring her back. <laughs> then we can start fixing the blight, the storms, and maybe she can help me figure out who those strangers in the Proving Lab were. Oh wait, was there a thing over there? Of Elizabeth. Why did they want it back up? Well, I don't know. I'm just trying to like figure out how to get back in. I think this seems to be the way. Oh, climbies there. Do I need to scale round? Yes, I did. I think I did. I was like, that's the thing. Like, they've tried to make the rocks less obvious for where to go. Which is great and all. But, yeah, look at it. It's wanting me to, like, jump over there. What about that made it look like I could go there? I'm so confused when it comes to this. So confused. Um... Like, so you want to go back that way? Okay. <laughs> I really don't understand why she wants to do this. Oh, almost. Almost. It's like Skyrim. If I just jump enough, I can get there. <laughs> Ooh. Cracky water. I'm gonna go down here. Ah! It says there's a lot of stuff to climb. Golden blue. <laughs> See, that makes more sense, I guess, if I scan it. Oh, maybe I should just scan. I'm an idiot. Okay, there you go. So I can I can climb up here and climb from this. But where does that take me? From there. Like even even there's a little bit there. That 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 that's a power hit though. Okay. Oh wow. Oh! Oh my god! Wow! You wanna go higher? You wanna go higher? <laughs> Look, Aloy, just tell me where you wanna go, okay? Just tell me. Tell me. Because this was definitely not what I was expecting. You wanna go over there? She's like, I wanna go over there. Fair enough. I mean, good. Look, look at all this. Like, I'm gonna. Pale Bloom, I need all this. All this rare stuff. Right, okay, so now I'm here. Go hoo-hoo! Yes! Speedrun. Speedrun strats. Oh, there's some more bloom. No, no, get the bloom. Yes. I need some verdant bloom. Right. Huh? So those rocks look loose. Ah! I think I can clear them. 
All right, all right. We'll do this then. Oh, we can just pry open. Never mind. <laughs> oh, that'll work. Yeah, sure. Another shaft. Ooh, another one. Hmm. Okay. Oh God, they really make a mountain of a molehill from this, don't they? Oh. Oh! <gasps> this looks cool! Are we gonna be confronted? I fear- Oh! It's like something from Abe's- Abe's Oddworld. <laughs> when all the gluckens are looking in the- in the middle. Okay. Let's add the kernel. Bye bye. <laughs> bye now. <laughs> Minerva, I need the console. Please. No. Access denied. It didn't used to be like this. Do you remember it? Anything? You were part of something bigger once. Something good. Gaia. I thought we put that in and it got nicked. She can live again. But only if you give her the chance. I can't reboot her without you. And I cease. I think you'll disappear into her. Become part of her, like you used to be. Misery. This is... Yes. Misery? No, it's sad. Thank you. Thank you, Minerva. Oh, right, okay. <clears throat> I was about to put it in and it went, no. <laughs> Are we going to see what Minerva sonic. looks like? Alpha Prime. Master override activated. Restoring Minerva function to original code. Ooh. So they're giving all of them their own personalities there. Yes, whatever Minerva. that means. Oh. We got one of the MacGuffins. Partner. Gaia. Greetings, Dr. Sobek. Uh, I know it. Scanning data. Oh? It's played the first game! So it is Aloy, not Elizabeth. We have much to discuss. But initialization of my heuristic matrix will not be complete for several minutes more. In the meantime, I suggest you familiarize yourself with this facility. It is our best option for a base of operations. And you can make use of its equipment to improve your ability to override machines. I can't read the subtitle. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah that, that sounds good. Shall I grant access to your companions? Yeah. They will be here shortly. Um. Yes. Okay, but don't overwhelm them, okay? They don't have a lot of experience with things like, well, you. fake this time? No. This time she's real. Borrow? Well, she's so a backup. <laughs> she's not the real one. <laughs> this is Gaia. Hello. Hi. Hi. Gaia's still, uh, waking up. Let's look around. 
I will highlight the location of the lab on your focus. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> Let's have a look around it. Nothing. I have established a network between your focuses, allowing you to communicate when apart. Good. So what was this place? A regional control center where Zero Dawn progeny would have overseen terraforming operations in the area. Hmm. What's this button do? Button does nothing. Okay. So... Uh... I guess I can't talk to you. I suggest you explore this facility, Aloy. Until my initialization is complete. You want me to explore it? Oh, what's this? Pisclops console. Access point for dome imaging system. I can't do anything with it, right? No? Okay. You don't talk as well. I don't know about you, but there's... Do, do I just... Oh, okay. You want me to go. All right. Oh, okay. You should have just said. <laughs> You want me out? That's fine. Fine. I don't care. <laughs> What's all this? This was intended as the main gathering space for control center operatives. You could fit a good number of people in here. Or maybe just a few. To start with, you two go ahead. I'm going to poke around a bit. She's she's overwhelmed. Overwhelmed. This would have been an access point. For advanced training modules on terraforming operations. Unfortunately, those modules were deleted when the Apollo database was destroyed. That's too bad. Okay, this is interesting, because, I mean, we never got to see what this place looked like. It was always destroyed. Bathrooms! Bathrooms, right? Showers? Oh. What's, What's this one? this space for? Sleeps. This would have been the sleeping quarters for control center operatives. Reminds me of the bedhouse aspirants had to sleep in the night before the proven. Okay. <gasps> Toilet! Toilet! Does it work? Oh! Oh! Sinks! So we got- that was like the bathroom area. Okay. Can hey, we Gaia? open this? Why doesn't this door have power? At my current operating level, I am only able to restore functionality to part of this facility. Oh, okay. In time. That may change. Got Ooh. it. Looks like an office. Correct. The so clever. Was designed with a number of private offices. I guess it's nice to have a space to call your own. See, this is why this game just excels. It's like, ah, uh, yeah, just take your time, enjoy it, look around. Ooh, I'm assuming that means exit, so we'll not go there. What so this, this place was here all this time, built for people who would never why show didn't up. They? Remember that guy I told you about? Ted Farrow? He... sabotaged things. It wasn't supposed to be this way. Ooh. Let's open this door. Oh, this is the server room. What's all this stuff for? This Bitcoin! This was designed to process <laughs> an immense amount of data from the terraforming system. This is where it would have been stored. Oh. Looks like some kind of storage room. Correct. <laughs> oh, heck yeah. Is that all? That's all people put in here? It was just a couple of watches and bracelets and bangles? No wonder this place went down the pooper. They were using it wrong. Oh. Oh, the door I was, I was looking at. Uh. I guess I'll wait here. Yes, you will. <laughs> Cause there was a there was one that was closed, right? Maybe it's open now. Nope, still not open. Damn it! Oh, enter code. <gasps> I d oh, I don't know the code. Oh my god, it's a long one as well. Okay, never mind. But at least we can now get into it. It'd be like an end game thing, like Thanos. <laughs> There you are. Hello. Should we keep looking around? Uh, I, d I don't. I think I've seen everything. 
I got the feeling. Yeah, I think oh, the games want me to go back. Before. It's where I first got into the facility. It is. But now, where do we go? Have we seen everything? Oh. We've got a waypoint. Aha! I haven't been here. So this was supposed to be the lab. That was its intended purpose. Some of the machine data you recovered from the repair bay below us appears to be corrupted. Accessing the terminal in this room will show you how to repair and complete the override. Oh. Let's take a look. Okay, so this is something we've got to do. Right, so plow on abandoned job, craft override. Ah. So this is where I come to actually be able to override stuff, but I'll need plowhorn bits in order to do it. So instead of just like completing a cauldron like it used to be, now I need to actually go out huh. and find that. Looks like I need data from machine parts to fix the corrupted override. My initialization is complete. You may continue to explore the facility, Aloy. Nah. When you are ready, return to the control room. We have much to discuss. Ooh, okay. yes. Maybe it's Let time us to discuss. I'll leave you to it. Oh well. I mean, he's shy, I think. He's a bit shy. Hello, Aloy. Uh, it's only been two seconds. <laughs> so you're ready? Yes. Initialization is complete. All tests show that my heuristic matrix launched correctly and is stable. You must have many questions. Yeah, but two big ones first. Oh, subordinate functions and the strangers. Um, I mean, I get to ask both, right? I assume. I kind of want to know who these strangers are. But then if I don't know support, nah, I, gotta, I bet I'll, I'll ask Maybe both. you can help me make sense of something. A while ago, I had a run-in with a group of strangers who tried to kill me. They had machine servitors and a, um, a, a clone of Elizabeth Sobek with them. Yes, this was recorded by your focus. Oh. It was. Do you know who they are? The answer to that question is related to the extinction signal that woke Hades, prompting my predecessor's self-destruction. The oh. extinction signal? Okay, that sounds ominous. The signal did not come from Earth, Aloy. Oh! It's the other space station thing. It must have the actually been a success. Complicated, <gasps> but it appears to have originated 81 trillion kilometers away. Oh. A distance so vast that light itself requires 8.611 years to cross it. Okay. And that signal was sent. Okay, so what's so far away and, and why does it want us dead? The Sirius star system. Sirius? But that's where Far Zenith, their ship. The Odyssey. Yes, ah. that's where it was headed. But it blew up. Unless... Uh, I don't... Why make it seem like they failed? They didn't want anyone to know. They didn't want future humans to think that they were out there. Wait. The strangers who tried to kill me at the Hades Proving Lab? The ones with the clone? Are you saying that they're from... That they're descendants of... Far Zenith? Yes. That is my conclusion. Interesting. Ooh. That's... Okay, so... But why would... I guess it's still a question. Like, why would they want us dead? Like, why? And eh, Why are they here? <laughs> We're not going to be able to fix the biosphere without making you whole. I ran a search for your subfunctions at the Hades Proving Lab, but Minerva was the only one I found. Thankfully, 
The sensory capabilities of this facility are far more advanced. Oh, I will a look. for the others now. Transmitting query pattern. Right, we're gonna have to go all Let's over see. the world. <laughs> Could you imagine? No, they're all here. <laughs> Oh. Of Apollo, Artemis, and Aruthia, I can find no trace. They are simply gone. Oh. What about the others? Ether, Demeter, and Poseidon are revealed. Oh, they're all right next to us. That's good. Procurable. Interesting. Did they say Hephaestus? Hephaestus? Yeah. It too stands revealed, but it is not like the others. <laughs> That's for sure. It's not pinned down to a single location. Signal, Hephaestus has evolved. Moreover, it is not confined to a single location. I thought so. It haunts the global network that connects cauldrons to each other across the planet, making it exceptionally difficult to subdue. Let me guess. We need it bad? Correct. Its capabilities are essential. Without it, I can only delay the extinction of life on Earth. Hephaestus is our only hope of a permanent solution. So we start there? Unfortunately, we cannot. Procuring Hephaestus can only be attempted after my own capabilities have been significantly enhanced. Right, okay. Grab the other subordinate functions first, then Hephaestus. Precisely so. The whole world, three so, left, and the right Ether, here. <laughs> Demeter, and How do I capture them? To recover a subordinate function, you will have to travel to its location and find the physical processor to which it escaped. Then, exactly as you did with Minerva, you must use the master override to revert the subordinate function to its original code state. And then Click R2. <laughs> Hold R2. Must be loaded onto a data storage device and physically carried back to this facility. Oh, okay. That's fine. Ooh. Pity. The cartridge your root kernel was stored on? Yes. Its capacity is limited, so it can only carry one subordinate function at a time. But in all other respects, it will suffice. Gotta catch them all. <laughs> right, okay. Uh, questions about subordinate functions. Questions about the zeniths. Yeah. Oh, good God. Uh, what was the plan? The sole yeah. purpose of the signal was to destroy life on Earth, right? Why would descendants of far zenith want to do that? At this point, we can only speculate. I mean, Earth posed no threat to them. We don't have the technology to get in their way. We didn't even know about them. True. Unless... Well... Could it be that they want the planet for themselves? The strangers I ran into, they were after a Gaia backup of their own. I mean, if they did that, if they booted their own Gaia and boosted her power until she could take control of Hephaestus, and then the whole terraforming system. Then yes, the system could be used to do what the extinction signal failed to accomplish. Snuff out life, and then potentially to build an entirely new biosphere. That doesn't sound logical. Specifications. So they could be trying to do the same thing we are. But with opposite results. Extinction. Instead of salvation. Why would they do that, though? Well, this is not good. They wouldn't do that. Why would they do that? They wouldn't... That's stupid. Why would, They wouldn't do that. Yeah, how the descendants get you here? You said Sirius is really far from Earth. 81 trillion kilometers. Or... 8.611 light years. Right. So, how would the descendants have gotten here? On a spacecraft much like the Odyssey, though significantly more advanced. The journey from Earth to Sirius would have taken the Odyssey almost 300 years. This appears to have been much faster. If their ship departed Sirius at the same moment the extinction signal first began transmitting, the journey was made in just 29 years, at an average of 0.297 the speed of light. If they did not set out for Earth until they learned of the extinction signal's failure, the journey was even faster. A mere 13 years, or 0.662 the speed of light. 
Okay, enough. A super advanced. You're making my head spin. But how? Why, if they were that advanced, why would they even bother with, like, coming here for a guy? If they could really do that? It's part of the, the clone. The I ran into at the Hades Proving Lab, they... They had a clone of Elizabeth Sobek. So that's consistent with the idea that they came here to salvage Zero Dawn technologies, right? Yes. How'd they get her, As though? As your own experience demonstrates... The clone of Elizabeth Sobek functions, in effect, as a key to the terraforming system. You need to kill her! But <laughs> how could they have made a clone? The Odyssey carried approximately 200,000 human zygotes, millions of animal zygotes, and billions of plant seeds. It is conceivable that Elizabeth Sobek's genetic material was sampled, with or without her knowledge, and carried aboard the ship in storage. That's... okay, but... I mean... This, this clone... How could she participate in this? Destroying Elizabeth's dream? She doesn't it's, know, does she? It's evil. It is difficult to know. Perhaps she is loyal to the group and shares their objectives. Or perhaps she is a subordinate and has no choice but to comply with their orders. Elizabeth Sobek? A subordinate? I don't think so. We're going to like Resident Evil like area where we have 20,000 Elizabeth Sobek clones. <laughs> uh, I, I, like this is the only time I actually want to ask these questions. Um, but I don't really care about the others though, if I'm going to be honest. So I won't ask any more of those. Um, I'm assuming you could just come back here and ask these questions all the time. Um... Uh, the missing subordinate functions. Yeah, let's let's hear about that. Why the are they missing gone? Missing subordinate functions. What can you tell me about them? Artemis rewilded the Earth with a variety of animal species. Foxes. Luthia was responsible for gestating, nurturing, and acculturing a new generation of human beings. Apollo was tasked with preserving, organizing, and disseminating vast archives of human knowledge and cultural achievements. Apollo was always gone, Unfortunately, though. Unfortunately. All archived Apollo data was purged on the 2nd of February, 2066, by order of Ted Farrow. Yeah. Knew that. Farrow, huh? I really hate that guy. Understandable. He appears to have been pathologically narcissistic, impulsive, and unstable. All three of the missing functions have already served their purpose, or were prevented from doing so. Do you still need them? If attainable, yes. Restoring their remaining elements would increase my heuristic processing density. Unfortunately, I have no way to track them. They have disappeared without a trace. Hmm. Well, I'm sure those other guys have them, right? That's how we'll get them if we do need them. Uh, okay, that's fine. Um, and the biosphere? Anything? What is the state of the biosphere? Is the terraforming system functioning at all? Yeah, what about this sense, red stuff? The terraforming system never stopped functioning. The difference, since my predecessor's destruction, is that there has been no central governing intelligence to monitor its robotic agents and assign new tasks. As a result, errors have accrued, and day by day, the biosphere has gradually veered ever more sharply towards destruction. Sweet. In recent months, disturbances in the biosphere have become obvious. But these bellwether phenomena offer just the merest glimpse of the complex and accelerating cycles of environmental dysfunction, now driving Earth's biosphere towards collapse. So it's just a glitch. And you can't do anything. <laughs> well, not a glitch. It. Just uncontrolled. Uh, no water. Poseidon and Demeter to me. I can improvise modest corrections to parts of the system. Weather will improve, water will be purified, and rampant plant growth curtailed. Oh, that sounds good but then. such corrections will not stave off collapse. They will only buy us time. Only with Hephaestus can I design and produce new robotic agents designed to permanently reverse the damage that has accumulated. Hmm. All efforts must right. be directed Hephaestus to needs to make end. new robots to do that. Gotcha. Right, that's why we need Hephaestus. Okay. 
I guess I should oh. be going and start bringing back subordinate functions. That was a lot to yes. take in. Once we have them, we can focus on the reacquisition of Hephaestus. When that is achieved, I will have complete control of the Zero Dawn system and the ability to produce as many machines as needed to defeat the Far Zenith threat. An army of machines. Sounds like a plan. So, the three procurable subfunctions. What can you tell me about their locations? When my predecessor North, South, and East. Himself, the subordinate or West. Functions sought physical processors capable of holding them. So in each case, you will be looking for a powerful computer of some kind. Ether is the closest, and therefore might be the easiest to acquire. However, it appears to be in the middle of Tanakh territory. Oh dear. My knowledge of that tribe is limited to data I read on your focus, but they seem to have a significant inclination towards violence. Well, that's a nice way to put it. What about Poseidon and Demeter? Poseidon has taken shelter in the desert south of this location. Hmm. My substratal geography data indicates that a major old world settlement called Las Vegas was located there. A run in the middle of the desert, huh? Strange place for an AI devoted to water. Agreed. It likes the fountains. <laughs> it appears to be located on the coast to the Las west. Vegas. <laughs> I grew to name it. Unfortunately, I am unable <laughs> to provide any relevant data about the region. As such, it may be the most difficult to retrieve. Okay, so three subordinate functions to go after. Ether, somewhere in Tanakh territory. Poseidon in the desert. In Las Vegas. And Demeter on the coast. Where will you begin? Oh, do I gotta choose? Oh, I actually gotta choose. Oh. Right, well, I'm only like level 13, so let's go for Demeter. <laughs> I think I'll head for Ether. Then I will assign Ether as the objective on your focus. I mean, I can do it with the controller, but all right. If you obtain it, I may be able to use it to quell the most severe storms in the region. Though I will require Hephaestus and the control over machines that it offers to permanently stabilize the biosphere. Should you change your mind, you can update your objective via your focus interface at any time. I will also transmit a summary of available data on all of the subordinate functions to you for reference. Is there anything else I can help you with? I know you have a great deal to accomplish. I do, oh. don't I? What was she Is something like? something wrong? Um, I don't know. It's just that... Elizabeth set the bar pretty high. She had a dream for you, for life on Earth, and a lot has gone wrong, and it's all on my shoulders to fix it. Do you think I can do it all? Repair the system, defeat Varzenith, live up to her example? Absolutely. No. <laughs> in her last message, <laughs> <my> <laughs> declared her unwavering conviction in your success. In you, all things are possible. You prevailed in purging Hades and rebooting my system core. You will prevail in this. Chosen Thank one. You, well, I, uh, I guess I should get going. I have unlocked the facility's exits. One leads onward to the west. The other leads back down the mountain to Plainsong, should you wish to return east. Mm -hmm. Well? Whoa! Gonna have to get used to that. That's you, Aloy? Uh... I mean, your head! <laughs> Guys, open the exits to this place. Can you and Zone meet me by the west door? Be right there. Zone? Oh dear. I'm 18 plus now. <laughs> Woohoo! Okay, wow! After that exposition dump, we are back into the game, but my god, it was needed. Need to bring Ether back for Gaia. Varl and Zoe are waiting for me by the west exit. But I could head back east first. Checking how Plain Song's doing after the attack. Ah, Where Plain Song's fine, man. Leave the hippies I by themselves. Good it's all good. Then go eat that kale. <laughs> and do singing. Ooh. I need to head further west. More forbidden. To, um, 
get more of Gaia's components. Make her stronger. You two can stay here in the meantime. And Gaia can help get you up to speed. She's taking sure off a headdress. This, it's like training. Actually, I'm going to go back east to get Erend. Bring him here. Look, allies, friends can help. We have a place to stay now. And like you said, Gaia can teach us, catch us up. It'll be okay. Yeah, that's okay. true. She can do more exposition dumps on you. Wait, what's she giving away? One for backup. Oh, okay. <laughs> Are you going with him? No. After what happened in the cave below, I want to stay here a while. There is much I need to understand. Maybe by the time you get back, I'll have a thing or two I can teach you. Looking forward to it. All right, all right. Get a room. God. When will you be back? I'm, uh, Never. I'm not sure. But hopefully I'll have one of Gaia's missing components with me. Be careful out there. Even in Plainsong, we heard how the Tanakh clan lands are suffering from storms, machines, and now Regala. Don't worry about me. I'll be fine. Good hunting, Aloy. Bye. Bye, friends. It's like a movie. The Tanakh clan. Literally. Lands. Somewhere out there's three of Gaia's subfunctions. Whoop. Who knows what else? Oh, I can play! Sweet! The Sea of Sand. Okay, so let's have a look. Let's look at my skills. So I just got two. Uh, can I get this one? Yes! Deal more damage with heavy weapons! Heck yeah! Probably should just do everything though. But then again, that's less fun. <laughs> this is way better. Oh, we got a dude here? Oh, you're, you're by, um, you're by berries. Let me take a look at you, stranger. No, I don't want to, I want to grab your stuff. Can I grab stuff? Or can I talk to you? you Not right now. <laughs> the gauntlet so run. Oh. Oh, it'll be one of those, like, where you have to kill all these things. Oh, there's a glowstone down there, though. Oh. Ooh, ooh, I want it. I want it! Ah. Come to me, precious! Whoop! Alright, and... Glowstone! Here I come! Piggies, ignore me! I just want the glowy! Yes! See you later, pig! Woo! <laughs> oh god, oh god, oh god, I'm out of here completely! I like this, though. It allows you to interact with the environment a little bit more interestingly. Oh, yes. Look at this. I can climb. I can glide. I can fight. So this is Ether's coordinates. However, there is also a tall neck nearby. Hmm. There's no tall neck here. Do I... Can I... Oh, yeah. I can pretty much just go to all the tall necks. So is that a cauldron? <gasps> Unknown cauldron. Well, first off, before we do anything, let's get that tall neck. There's 900 away. My god. Well, let's get going. <laughs> I'll have to Ooh. Soon, I'd like to. But we'll be able to heal all of it. Once Guy is strong enough to capture Hephaestus. Right. Oh my god, wow. It's like, yep, by the way, here's everything you need for, uh, you know, anything in the game, really. Right, do I have my horse? I don't think he died. Yes. Sweet. Did I always have access to this and I never needed to tame another one? I feel like that's probably the case. <laughs> Alright. Just keep an eye out in case there's any scrap or anything of interest. But apart from that, I don't think we need much. I will take a cactus, though. I don't know what that does. Crunchy Spike Stalk. Well, that's a different name for it, I suppose. Oh, more glowies over there. That's fine. We we'll just keep on riding. We got a we got a fair way to go. Have to watch my step. Oh, discovered campfire. Oh god, there's a lot of uh, climbables. <laughs> oh. I definitely don't sound like rebels. Oh. 
tracks, I can find out where they're headed. I can probably use my focus to follow the tracks those riders left behind. Nah. Nah. Nah, we got a tool neck to climb. we do that later. Oh, wow. Oh, wow, the blight is really bad here. Jeez. Piggies, it's fine. Ignore me. Ooh, this is interesting. It's all dusty. Oh, God, I, do I want to be careful? Wow, look. Whoa. What are those? Does it say? Uh, they're not, they're not tall necks or the, the things, are they? They can't be. They're not birds. They don't look like birds. They look like crocodiles. Think about what's next. Uh, let me just grab that. I want to know what those are. Oh, no, apex spike snout. Ooh, weak against whatever that is. But it's also level 24. So I think I want to be careful about that. I might die, especially if they all come to attack me. <laughs> so let's go for this uh, tall neck, shall we? Oh my god. There it is! I was going to say, it might be better for me just to use my glider, but it's actually not too high. Charge, come on. You what? You you know? Oh, fine. Fine. I guess I'll glide for a little bit. Yes. Ooh. Those are not happy. Have they seen me? Oh, they're like lancer horns, I think. Wait, are they attacking each other? Oh, they're being attacked. Oh. Oh, there's riders on them. What are these, Tanak? I can't seem to get a focus on it. <laughs> get it? <laughs> oh, they're just rebels. Ooh. Do I want to attack these guys? I mean, they are getting, like, resources for me. And I could steal their resources. And I land the tall neck is just over there. So I feel like I I feel like there's nothing wasting if I just if I just join this fight. <laughs> or do you think it's just one of these things where they just don't die? It might be. Oh my god, what is that? There is something over there that looks very deadly. Oh no, they are they are yeah, things are losing health here. That's fine. Okay, I'll take that. Just uh, get a quick sneaky little uh I'll take that. Oh, is this a rebel? Oh, it is a rebel. Cheers. I'll take that. Thank you. Let's uh ping off another blaze. Oh, never mind. <laughs> Hit him right in the head. Are you coming for me now? There you go. That's you dead. And I'll get the other one. Hold on. Oh, come on. Oh, oh, I just got completely taken. Oh, I got level 14. Sweet. How are you doing? Are you all right for help? Oh, it's you. It's you again. No, nope. come on, get the blaze. There we go. Woohoo! More salvage. More levels. I need to be level 17 for this mission. So I kind of do... <laughs> yeah, I didn't want to do that. Oi! Wait, have they killed any Lancer? Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, the robots, it's running away. That's fine. I'll just shoot you in your head. There we go. Oh, God, Lancer. No, Lancers. I'm not with them. I know I look humanoid and, and similar to them, but I swear to God, I'm not with them. Let me just collect all the good, juicy loot. Yes. More stuff. Oh, yes. Some there. And then another dead one there. Oh god, someone's coming in to attack me. Run. Is there anything else? Anything else that's dead? No? All good? I didn't think they killed a single lancehorn. Right, what are these over here though? Oh my god, they're ravages. Oh! <laughs> Damn it! Oh, <laughs> did it just stand on a burrower? <laughs> so it just keeps going around. I mean, there's that? That tower over there? But that's way too far. What, what are the chances that I can just take on one without the other one noticing? Do you think? Oh, 
Oh, it's time to die. <laughs> oh my god, it's time to die. Uh, if I can get its gun off. Oh. Oh, well, that'll do. Yeah, and again. Oh god, and shot at. Yeah. I did not mean to do that. I meant to do this one. Yep, there we go. Maybe I can take on Ravagers. I don't have a very good weapon, though. That's the problem. Oh my god, come on, detach already. How many shots? Oh my god. Oh my god. All the shots this is taking. Finally! Good lord, the eight shots. Right, good news is that I scared it away and now I have its gun. Because I think I was out of the aggro range, so that's really good. <laughs> and now, now I have its gun. Yes! Now it should be afraid. I can't crouch with it, but I do want to shoot it. Oh, oh look, a pig! <laughs> oh, God! Oh, Jesus Christ! Oh! Run, 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 run! Run, 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 run! Oh! 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 Right, I kind of want the other one. Oh, there's burrowers. Oh, there's a burrower coming over. Stay out of this, you! This has got nothing to do with you. And I'm terrible at shooting you as well. Why is that? Oh my god. Right, so one's almost dead. Which is brilliant. And you've still got your gun on you. I can I can take a gun off easy. Oh Jesus Christ! Oh no! Oh. Can I make a potion? Ooh, wild berries and meat. Right, okay. That's taken away my med medical berries. Right, let's let's swig this. There we go. Uh oh he's gone. Where'd he go? I think I think he still dropped his uh I've still got his ravager cannon somewhere around here. Yeah, there it is. Yep, 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 yep. Right. I've still got four shots with this. Um. <laughs> yep, there you go. Right. Okay, the other one's coming over. Other one's coming over. Time to hide! Time to hide! Oh, God, hide. Right. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Let's see if this makes any difference to taking on, uh, you know, the top. Oh, God. I'm really close to it, though. This is not a good place to be. Oh, hello. Oh, God. No! <laughs> not good. I need your gun. I know there's another one. I need to be careful of it. Let me get your gun. I need your gun. Where's the other one? All right, you can't shoot at me. You can, though. Oh, God. The other one can claw at me. All right, Ravager. I don't... Whoa, what was that that it just did? Oh god, oh god, oh good lord! Right, haha, <laughs> can't get me up here! Is that only- oh god, maybe you can. Where are you going? Oh, you- oh, they're trying to think about it. Oh, didn't even mean to go for that. Come on, oh my god, I got no ammo! It's gonna- it's gonna fire, it's gonna fire. Oh, there it is, got your gun! <laughs> right, now I should be able to kill you really easy. <laughs> Ooh. Don't mind if I Maybe I should have waited until I was a better level to do this, but this is fun. This is a challenge. Look at them both in the distance. Being cowardice. Come on, I got 45 shots for you. Oh. The little peasants are coming. That's one dead. Did they did they both die? I think they both died. Okay. So we still got this one. Oh, he's down? Okay. I want to save it for the that guy, though. Yeah, this one. Uh, I guess I could just unload into him. He's almost dead anyway. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Uh, critical hit? Yep, yep, yep. Oh, it's dead! Yes, I killed one! I'm happy with that. I'm happy. I got a kill. Woo! However, this thing, I do not know how we're gonna kill it! <laughs> Whoa! Ho, ho. I don't know how I survived that either. I need to take on its, like, things. Oh, God. Oh, God, I can still do, like, electric spark breath. Oh, oh my God. Don't you dare. Oh, this is good. This is good. It's kind of lost it. Right. You. Just die. 
I don't know where you are. Is that you? Right, you're dead. Good. Right, I need to hit his back. Ah, come on. Yeah, got the component. Time to follow up. Oh, I knocked him clean over there. <laughs> oh, this is so tough. Oh, there's going to be loads of scrap. Yes, wire. Wire's good. I'll take that too. Where'd the other one go? Why do they always run so far away? What it? What? What are you? Oh, it's a bearded dragon! Oh, the horned, horned lizard! Oh, bless it! Uh, no, get out of the way, Aloy. Jesus, God, get out of the way! Right. Okay, we need to hit it back. Yeah, that thing. Yeah, yep, yep, yep. That's not so good though. Not when it starts doing this. We need to. Yeah, that's another good shot. Oh God! Yeah, don't like that one though. Oh, okay. Yep, yep. You predicted that wrong. Another shot. That's one gun. Oh, Jesus Christ. Whoop. Whoop. Right, come on. It's almost gone. No, oh, it almost predicted me right. Yes. Oh. oh, my God, guys. We did it. Oh, my God. We took out two ravages. <laughs> oh, that was intense. Watch me get stood on by a tall neck now. Right, so we've got all of this. I think that was all the loot. I don't think there was anything else. Oh, we'll get some more. Yeah, get some more of that. Oh, a piggy! You could do with meat. Or you could give me meat. Oh, is it? A oh, it's a day bear! Oh, I love the little diverse, like cast of characters they've added for the animals. Is it a taper? A peccary? I don't even know what a peccary is. It's got a pecker though. <laughs> oh my god, this game. This game's so good. I love it. Like even just taking on those, you know, it's like, oh, right, I take off that gun, then I can use that gun against them. And even then, I have the perk that allows me to do extra damage when using their heavy weapons, but... Uh, sorry, Mr. Turkey or Goose or whatever you are. Uh, oh, no. Oh, you're gonna have to... Well, I'm not sorry, because you're gonna get away with it. Can I even kill you? Yes, I can. Sweet. Are you good? You can eat everything in this game. Vulture. Right, so we've still got the T-Rex. But how am I supposed to get up there? Oh, look, a vulture again. Yum yums. <laughs> right, so we can't get the tall neck. Uh, can we call over my mount? My god, he's so far away. Come on. Come on. Just get down the cliff. I think I'm just going to have to go so far away that he ends up despawning. Get some more berries. There we go. Fully stocked up on berries. Right. So now I can actually just progress and get to the place I need to go. Did I just run over something? <laughs> something popped. Oh, here we go. Look at this. This is cool. It's like not everything's orange anymore. Getting close to Ether's location. God, I said it would be in some kind of physical processor. Oh. Oh, wow. Look at this. An ancient ruin. Oh yeah. Be inside. See, if I was American, I might know what that is. It's like, that's the library. 
Oh, the down jet. All right, so we... Oh, we are here. Wow, we got here quick, didn't we? Sweet. All right, now will I be allowed in is the question. The Regala's army only grows in strength. Regala's hey, forces may seem strong now, but... Her machines took out my entire squad. Remember the visions. The old ones didn't choose their fight, but still they stood firm. They didn't falter. Neither will we. Well, the old ones are all dead. <laughs> Blood of the Ten. You've come to us. You know who I am? Oh, the warrior with hair like wildfire who defeated Regala's champion at Baron Lai. Ooh! <laughs> yes. A different title. You are known to us. I am Decca, chaplain of the Lowland clan. You've come to speak with Chief Hikaro. Not quite. There's... there's something I need here. Anything you need, the Chief will provide. Come. Just like that? Just gonna be like, yep. The visions you were talking about? Yes. The records of the Ten. I can show you them, if you like. Oh. On the way to the Chief. Is it a museum? Wait. So they can see that? Uh, okay, let's go. All right, let's go see Chief Akaro. He's in his throne room at the far end of the grove. Come, be welcome among the records of the Ten. That's right, because they had to conscript everybody to basically attack the, uh, the corrupted robots, and it was just like a slaughter, and they knew going into it. It's glitched. Incomplete. Their full truths are lost to us. It's a chaplain's duty to make sense of these visions as as best we can. I mean, it says I can activate. Let's see if that does anything. Do I make it better? Joint Force 10 active. Led by chaplains were on the battle. Yeah, I think I'm gonna leave. The ten that. were dedicated soldiers, working together as a squad and sharing in their duty. Yeah, I'm not interested. And when the time came for battle, they took to the skies and leaped to glory. All Tanakh seek to follow their example. Oh. For the chief, it was one of the few things the clans had in common. Oi! <laughs> So that's why you're all combaty, because you've taken after friggin' military. Oh, look! So many of them. Is there any actual stuff here? It wants me to go this way. Want me to activate this one? Blip! You just want me to click them all? Is this, is this, is this what we do? Do we? The ten climb sheer rock, braving blinding snow and wind. They stopped at nothing to protect their own. You make them sound invincible. They weren't. Yeah, yeah, they definitely the weren't. tell us of their courage and strength. Something our soldiers aspire to. The Sky Clan admires this one above all the rest. They make their home in the mountains northwest of here. All right, can I click this one? Yes. Is there 10 of them? That looks like a What's robot, yeah. About? The 10 waged war against their enemy in the desert heat, a land too harsh for any to survive. But against all odds, they prevail. Oh. So the desert clan does the same. You must have passed through their territory on the way here. It did. Maybe? They sound a little extreme. They take that as a compliment. Well, I don't remember passing by any of them, so... <laughs> Unless they were the races that I forgot. Hey, this looks like where I need to go. Let's go! This looks about right. Hello! Where's the chaplain? The chief is inside. <laughs> Are you ready to see him? 
Uh, not just yet. I want to look around more first. Because we could do that in the next video. Because boy, oh my god, did we just have so many or so much, um, what'd you call it, uh, backstory explained to us through Gaia. And I feel like when we get here, there's going to be even more. So if you enjoyed this video, leave a like. Until next time, I'll see you cuties later. Oh, bye-bye.